Oh, hold on, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. So Jesse's trying to get on here. He's uh, he's saying Zoom with Mike B, but it's, he's not. He's not no, nope, he needs to figure it out. All right, guys. Tell him to raise his hand when he gets in. Um, all right, so we're recording. So hey, welcome to the special coronavirus edition happy hour of EXP Explained. I need to get my drink. Get a drink, dude. This has been a crazy week, and I appreciate everything you guys have done um, this week, you know, to... Um, to power through it, to still list homes, to just do everything that you're doing. Like, it's been so amazing. But here's what's happened to you guys, like for reals. The agents are scared, right? The agents are desperate. The agents are tripping out right now. And they're saying, okay, we're seeing all the biggest leaders in the industry move to eXp. Now, what was happening before, two years ago, was it was kind of a, a you know, a beginner company, an MLM -y feel company, you know, all this weird stuff that people had these weird feelings for. And now we have the best of the best. The best of the best are here or coming. And that's a fact. If I, I wish I could go down a list of some of the names that are on their way over right now that are on LOIs, selling brokerages, doing all kinds of weird things. The people that are going to be coming in the next 30, 60, 90 days are going to be mind blowing. So I just love it. I want this webinar to be somewhat evergreen. Um, Jesse, you can't be on unless you have your happy hour cocktail. <laughs> that a boy. Olive, <laughs> olive oil. Kale, kale juice. <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm cooking dinner. You guys are drinking. I'm cooking dinner, you know? It's all good. It's <laughs> hey, it's 430, dude. All right, yeah. so I want to I get this explain, explain started. Um, maybe you guys can monitor some of the questions and answers. This is not going to be the 30 minute usual, like let's hurry up, get through it. Only the major points. I'm going to be doing screen sharing. I'm going to tell you awesome things. I'm going to show you awesome things. And I'm going to take you guys into the world of eXp that you normally don't get to see or hear about. So it's going to be long. I'll tell you that right now. And happy hour is an hour. So let's do this thing. I'm going to share the presentation. And I'm going to just kind of roll through it. And let's see if I can minimize that, open that, see if I have the right one up. I'm going to assume I do. Hey, for those of you that do not know me, my name is Mike Bjorkman. I've been in the business since 1991. Um, I have, I had a large brokerage with 300 agents. I was at Remax for 20 years. I was at KW for five. Uh, I own a property management company with 600 properties. We do a whole bunch of transactions. I still run a team and I went to eXp when I decided that I was going to be out of business in the next three to five years if I still stayed at my brokerage and ran my current brokerage. And it was, it was one of those opportunities that would just be ridiculous to pass up. So I'm going to change that view. All right. So also with me, I have David Golden and Jesse Zagorski on this. Uh, I asked them to come on. Uh, they're good friends. They like to do webinars and they all, they bring a couple other little things. And Jesse's, Jesse just kind of popped in to say hi. And like I said, we're going to have a couple other people pop in. And if you think you have something really cool to add to this, you can raise your hand. I'll try to uh, pay attention to that and let you guys in. So this is going to be like a freestyle thing. Look, it's not even in presentation mode. Um, it's a happy hour. It's what we're doing. Yeah, exactly. I love it. <laughs> so here's, here's what we're going to cover. And I like this slide. It'll keep me on track a little bit. Who are we at eXp? What does our business model look like? Uh, eXp World, eXp Solutions, and joining eXp. Um, I should probably go back to David a little bit, who's my sponsor, who I'm forever grateful for bringing me to this company. He was a uh, number three recruiter at KW for years, uh, opened a couple brokerages, to over 300 agents for KW, number one REO agent in Nevada. Um, so he knows what he's doing when it comes to recruiting and business. He's very smart and he's basically retired now from selling homes, which is <laughs> really cool. Oh, Larry's on too. And then uh, Jesse Zagorski, I mean, I could I'd probably let you guys say that by yourselves, but I'll brag for you. Jesse Zagorski runs a massive team in San Diego. We all met back in the REO days. He's a business analyst, systems analytical, super fun guy. Uh, one of the best sales trainers I know, one of the best team leaders I know, uh, knows everything you could possibly imagine. Dave and Jesse run DS Pros, Default Network uh, Services. It's an REO network that we all met in. So these guys just bring a whole crap ton of value uh, to my life, to your life, to everybody's life. Uh, do you guys want to throw anything in there or should I go on with the prez? 
Well, go ahead. Roll with it, man. You're doing right. great. I was trying to get a little drink in. All, All right. right. I, so I can stall for you. There you go. If you guys haven't heard about Glenn Sanford by now, you're uh, living under a rock. Glenn is one of those guys who's a complete and total visionary, you know, like Bezos or uh, Michael Dell or, you know, God, I mean, some think of some of the smartest computery geeky people on the world that started these companies that are just amazing. Elon Musk, those types of guys. There's three reasons that what Glenn did all came together. Number one, he was very techy. He was involved in startups during the dot com. He was very successful with that. Right. Um, so he has, he brings a lot of tech to the field. Then he opened up or he got into real estate, he kind of pioneered online leads and really understood online lead generation and actually opened a brokerage. Similar to me, he, and, and this is a conversation I had with him in Sacramento when I was speaking for Brent Gove up there. Uh, I actually got a chance to sit down with him by myself and hear his story. And the, the most memorable part for me was he said, Mike, you know, from owning a brokerage, agents don't need brick and mortar. They don't come into the office unless they want to gossip, pick up their mail, or pick up a check, right? I'm like, yeah, you're absolutely right. He, he saw early that, look, we didn't need brick and mortar, but the internet at that time started becoming very stable, right? Uh, the other thing I should point out, the third thing is that he was involved in stocks as a stockbroker, and he knew a lot about um, startups and building companies and taking them public. So if you can picture those three things, super tech, stockbroker and real estate put those three things together and 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 most of us and all of us at, at the leadership side of um exp we all came from keller williams right if at any point in your career when you go to the next level you end up at keller williams which is normal we all came from there i'll just say it we even stole our revenue share model from keller williams profit sharing model it's not a secret and and these guys when they get together they understand that look why fix something if it's not broken so Glenn started eXp, founded it in 2009, and he said, Mike, now that the internet is stable, we can do what we need to do. We could live in a cloud-based environment, and we're gonna talk about that in a few seconds. So just know Glenn's a badass. Um, so people think that eXp is new. People think that eXp is not gonna stay around. People think that it's an mlm -y thing, and people think that we're only here to recruit, and I wanna, kind of crush some of those myths and rumors. And I'll tell you why. So eXp was founded in 2009. That wasn't yesterday. That's not new, right? We opened in 11 states in one year. That's pretty powerful. Like I opened up three offices in five years and they were all in the same county pretty much for, the, for crying out loud. I like to talk about Steven Swanepoel. If you don't know who he is, he's another visionary. He's, he's kind of like a weird mad scientist. This dude, he looks at real estate trends and he can predict the future. And in 2011, basically what he said is he was going to take over the world or EXP was going to take over the world. So I was super stoked about that. Um, you know, founder, uh, CEO of the year, top 100, most influential. But here, 2013, we go public. Like who opens a company in four years and goes public, right? Um, yes, we were an over-the-counter stock. We were a penny stock which is still the same as FedEx or UPS or whatever. So that's still pretty awesome, right? Um, then we launched in Canada, dude, five years. So you guys kind of getting this, we're not new, we're not a fad, we're not a trend, we're not going anywhere. So in 2015, Glenn and the guys launched the Icon and Equity Agent, Agent Equity Program. That is ridiculous game changer in the real estate business. We're gonna go over that in a little bit too. 2016 we triple our agent uh we triple our agents so what happened was is exp attracted some really big heavy hitters that were very influential and that spread like wildfire um what i really like to talk about here is when we come over to 2018 we got uplisted to the nasdaq our uh, moniker is expi we're a very stable stock even in this time uh, if you compare us to rheology you'll see why uh, why I say that. So if you think in your head that we are a fad or we're a trend, you're dead wrong. We're not going anywhere. You can't take a company like this and watch us go away. It doesn't work, right? So now we've exceeded 28,000 agents. And Dave Kennard, the president of eXp, told me himself the other day that we're averaging 1,000 agents a week this month. So while we're all going and shut down through corona scarcity or whatever you call it, 
agents are flocking to our company and this is the reason why I wanted to do this. You guys asked for this. Um, so I'm going to talk about it. Core values. When people are giving EXP presentation, they skip over the core values. And I say, don't do that. It's not good because these core values are pretty much the same core values I have. And if you have longevity in the real estate business, if you're ethical and if you're successful, I would bet if you read these core values, you guys have a lot of these core values too. Are you fun? We're fun. I went to a couple conventions. It's all hugs, not handshakes, right? These people are all collaborative. They're all happy, high five and hugging. They're not rolling around with their medals and showing off and how many homes did you sell? And they're all just say, how could we have more fun? How could we build this company more stable? How could we build this company you know, to the next level? That's cool. Agile, you can see how agile we are. We're pivoting in this market faster and stronger than any other company, period. Every single day, if you set up a Google alert for a keyword for eXp and watch what people are saying about us, it's mind-blowing. Verbella, the tech that we own that is our virtual office, watch what that company's doing right now, right? So we do have integrity. We're very innovative. Um, there's 500 employees that totally care about service for us. Uh, sustainability. I'll go into that in a minute and tell you why and how we're so sustainable, collaborative and transparency. Man, <laughs> this company is very transparent. I'll tell you that for sure right now. Let's move on to our business model. So I, I you know, Dave, are you there by any chance? Yeah. He's probably getting a drink. I'm here. Hey, talk, talk real quick, like a minute. Just tell us about the cash flow quadrant. Let's just start with that real quick. So I wish I had a screen share here for this too, but. Um, so basically Robert Kiyosaki, the author of Rich Dad, Poor Dad <clears throat> was pretty much the first book I ever read as an adult, uh, right when I got into real estate at 18 years old and, um, and his concept was really powerful for me. And I, his, his next book after that was called the Cash Flow quadrant. It's pretty, it's pretty big and pretty long, but the, the basis of it is, um, there's four, there's four quadrants that you need to focus on basically, or that exist. Um, the employee or the E quadrant and the S quadrant, the self-employed or small business quadrant are on the left side. And that's where the 95% of us all live. And then on the right side of the quadrant where the wealthy 5% live is the uh, investor quadrant and also the big business owner or like 500 or more employees um, a quadrant, right? So, so one, of my, one of my biggest takeaways is that I got to be on the right side of the quadrant, right? And as, and as, a, as a realtor, we're all stuck in this self-employed quadrant at the bottom left, right? And so even as a broker owner and you think you're a business owner, you're really not a business owner. You're, you're, you're still self-employed, which means you own a job because you can't leave for six months or a year and your business grows without you. That's a business. A business is one where you can walk away for six months like Warren Buffett, right? But Warren Buffett owns businesses, right? He doesn't have to work in the business at all. So if you're working in your business, you don't run a business, right? You own a job. So I, I help realtors understand that. And then I help them understand that for us as a, as a real estate company, uh, the, the business quadrant for us is revenue share because that is a true business that you can walk away from and it grows without you. And then because we give you guys stock, um, EXPI stock for doing what you already do, sell homes and also for referring agents to the company, right? You can buy it at a discount and whatever. We'll get into that later. But but basically that's the I quadrant. So that's the investor quadrant. You own a stock, you own equity in your brokerage, right? You're not going to own equity in Central 21. You're not going to own equity in, you know, whatever other, whatever the real estate company, you name it real estate company, right? So here you have Keller Williams had it, had it a little bit, right? With the, with the business side, with the profit share, but it's really not a business because if I recruit Mike to Keller Williams and he closes a million dollar house and, and the franchise he works at does not make any money, I make zero. So it's not a true business because you can't build a business on that. So they kind of had it a little bit right and we took it and made it a true business. So basically EXP offers you the self-employed quadrant, which is what we're all in, selling houses, right? And then also gives you the business quadrant and then also gives you the investor quadrant. So no other real estate brokerage gives you those two opportunities like we do. Yeah, keep that in mind. That's why I wanted him to say that before we went too much further so you had a mindset. Brent Go, what's up my brother? Come off that, hey. what's up? What hey up, man. How you doing there? Going. Thanks for joining us, man. If you guys go this year, is, he's a legend in the industry. He's he was at Remax for almost 20 years like me. He went to the top. We were all top this, top that. 
we both kind of had the same cruise. We went over to KW, loved it, built our teams to 100 and 150 million dollar teams. And now Brent, I think, is the number three money earner at EXP. Brent, how many agents are you responsible for at our company right now? Well, I, I won't say that I'm responsible for so many agents, but we have over uh, 10,000 agents uh, and broker associates in our sales organization. So that's kind of fun. Man, that's amazing. Wow. So, so Brent, we're having happy hour. I know how much you love when we have happy hour. Um, coronavirus special, good boy. I know you're drinking your coffee, you weirdo. Um, but hey, man, I wanted you to take maybe two, three minutes Tell people how this company has changed your life. I'm going to go through the presentation and do all the, the expexplained.com or the modelexplained.com, but I want you to speak from the heart just for one to three minutes and say what you've seen and how your heart is about this company. Sure, sure, yeah. Um, I think like anyone, I started 24 years ago struggling, like, how do I get clients? So then how do I get clients who want to see property? Then how do I get clients who want to see property make offers? And then okay, how do I write offers and actually not lose? And then how do I get listings? And then, you know, how do I sell my listings? And then, you know, you get to the point where you're selling, you know, 48 homes a year, you're making three, 400,000 a year, at least in Sacramento, Northern California. That's what I made. Then they said, well, you know, if you're really doing good, hire a buyer's agent. And then if you're really doing good, maybe get two or three. And so I did that. Then I, they said, build a team. So I copied Craig Proctor, one of the top Remax agents in the world. He was actually the number one guy in the world. And I went from 48 sales a year to over 400. And then, but so my life prior to EXP is I carried 18 to 28 listings at all times. I handpicked, cherry picked the ones I wanted, 18 to 28. I had six listing specialists who took the listings I didn't want. So I had a business and, and um, 12 buyer specialists to handle the sign calls, internet leads, you know, referrals. And, um, and so I kind of had a business most people would be envious of. It was a great life, you know, and, um, you know, after expenses, you know, netting, you know, 600 to 1.3 million a year net, net income, not gross GCI. We're talking net you know, pay taxes. Um, after you could do everything you could to write it off, I had, that's what I had. And all of a sudden decades went by a few decades and then just, that's what real estate is. That's what I'm doing. Uh, you know, and you go to Remax's annual conventions, you go to Keller Williams, you do this thing called mega camp, uh, family reunion, and you just plug in and that's life. And that was it. And, you know, I had 18 agents on my team and three staff and me there and a couple part-timers, like 23, 24 of us. And that was it. And then along comes EXP Realty three years and four months ago. And I thought this might just work. And so in the next eight months, I sponsored or enrolled or listed 40 agents. And basically I, uh, you know, had people watch a webinar and then I listed them and uh, they joined our company. And I'd done that at Remax. I, people ask me how I like Remax. It's great. My 12 years at Remax, I probably had 100 agents join Remax. Um, I think I, I got to go to a dinner once or twice, a lunch once or twice, and one, two, three day weekends that trips to Ensenada on a cruise. <laughs> for sending them 100 agents, many of which sold 30, 40, 50, 60 homes a year, one of which sold 300 homes a year. And that year, of course, Remax got paid 300 times that year. I didn't even get a $10 Starbucks card. And um, so I go to Keller Williams, same things, not a recruiter, but people said, how do you like Keller Williams? Awesome. Had 55 people leave their brokerages and join Keller Williams on my recommendation. So it's a great company. Love it. And that resulted in an average of $700 a month profit sharing. Um, after eight years and hundreds and hundreds of people in what's called your Keller Williams profit share tree. Awesome. Great. Nobody else was doing that. Thumbs up Keller Williams. And then along comes a better model, eXp Realty. And, uh, you know, my first revenue share check for the first month was $1,900. <laughs> and that was for 10 days. Then the next month, November, 2016, for 30 days, it was $5,000, which is 60,000 a year. Not bad. The next month, my Keller Williams friends go, yeah, but it's not sustainable. It's not sustainable. You know, you can't keep it up. And, and I'm like, I didn't know I was new. 
And uh, so my third month, which was my second full 30-day period, it was $10,000. Not only was it sustainable, it doubled. Now, the fourth month, I expected it to double. I completely expected my revenue share to be $20,000 a month. I mean, it was doubling every month, 19 the first month, 5, 10. Why wouldn't it be 20? And my fourth month, it was 10,000 a month. Now, most people would be excited about having an extra 10,000 a month rolling in. And uh, I was not, I was upset about it. I thought EXP made a mistake. I thought they didn't count all the closings. And we actually went through line by line by line by line, like a visa statement and audited EXP. And the bottom line was the fourth month, we closed so many transactions that created X amount of revenue. And the revenue that was shared was correct, $10,000. So it was February, um, I think that month of 2017. And uh, it wasn't a big month and that's what it was. I was disappointed. I said, okay, so I'll end with this, Mike. My fifth month, I told my wife, it'll be 15,000 a month outside of real estate sales. I mean, you could chunk away your mortgage. You can retire sooner. This is all about retiring with dignity. An actual, if you have no plan, you're going nowhere. If you fail the plan, then you plan to fail. You gotta have a plan. So that fifth month, I promised my wife we'd make $15,000 outside of real estate for her invest, pay off the mortgage, whatever she wanted. And it was not 15,000, it was 25,000. So I've never made less than 25,000 a month. I think uh, eight months later, it was 55,000 a month, a month. You can budget on 55,000 a month. And then, and then it went to 100, then 200, then 300. And now it looks like 400 this summer, 500 this fall, it's pretty crazy. So uh, basically, it's been life changing. And the way we got there is by loving and serving our friends. And that's what EXP is about. That's what the management team at Coldwell Banker and Century 21 and Berkshire Hathaway and Keller Williams and Remax doesn't get. The model is the manager at Coldwell Banker or Century 21 or the team leader at Keller Williams or the manager at Berkshire Hathaway calls agents they don't know or hopefully they have some connection with and tries to recruit them. At EXP, we just call our friends. We call our family. We call people that love us and they join us. And we went from 1,300 to 28,000 in three years. And that 28,000, because we own the company with Glenn Sanford, we're shareholders. We own it in that way. In the way that we are shareholders, we get these stock awards. One team, one dream, baby. That 28,000 is going to go to 150,000. And everyone's going to just go, what just happened? And what just happened is EXP Realty. And then we're going to 400,000 in North America and um, a million within 10 to 15 years. You know, there's, there's 25 million agents and brokers worldwide. We'll have at least a million in the next 10 to 15 years. And uh, I'll end with this, Mike, and I'll hand it back over to you. You are not too late. Everyone worries, I'm too late. I should have done this two years ago, a year ago. You're not too late. Um, your timing is perfect. We have 28,000. There are 2 million agents in North America. It's just over 1% market penetration. Who are we? We're nobody. We are absolutely nobody. But baby, we are going to be somebody. You're, you're hearing about Netflix before Netflix was accepted. There was a point when everyone's like, Amazon, really some rainforest company. What a dumb name for a company. Well, they're the largest corporation in the world today. Uber, that's a re Uber, it sounds funny. Uber, really? Is that the best name you could come up with? I mean, now it's cool. Uber, hey, get an Uber, get a Lyft. Um, Google, like who thought Google would be a great name for a company? Well, they're very respected, Apple. So EXP, baby, um, within two, three, four years, the whole world will know the letters EXP, NEC, IBM, KW, CB, Century. There's, there's, everybody uses letters, EXP. Again, who are we? People will ask you what it was like to be here and did you take advantage? So now is the time. Best time to plant a tree was 30 years ago. Second best time is the day. So I hand it back over to you. Dude, so again, thank you, Brett. The legend, everybody's clapping, listening, I'm sure. So if you wanna see Brett and hear his story more, themodelexplained.com is typically the webinar that we ask people to watch. 
themodelexplained.com. There will not be cocktails. There will not be dogs barking in the background. It's Brent sharing his story. And I love you so much, man. You've been such a big inspiration and support for me. Uh, even in the chat box. Thank you, Mike. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Uh, Dave typed it in there. Thank you for that, Dave. So, dude, you, it means the world to me that you came on today. So let's let's move on with our presentation. And one thing I want to talk about is we're not a brokerage, right? We're, we're, we're a brokerage, one big brokerage. We're not a franchise. Um, so the interesting thing about that is when people say, how sustainable are you? And where does all the money go if you give it away in revenue share? Let me point out something very quick. I owned a franchise. I owned a territory, right? I had very expensive overhead. I couldn't work out of this circle. I hired agents because I had to keep the lights on, right? So when somebody sold a home, the big chunk went to me, the broker owner. Thank you. Here's the reality. When we're one big brokerage, you know, <clears throat> The way, the way real estate works is you have international up here, like Remax International, Rheology, whatever. And then below, what happens is they hire uh, or they sell um, regions, right? So you have a regional owner. The region's job is to sell franchise owners territories. And the franchise owner's job is to hire staff, hire a recruiter, and then, of course, hire what? Us. So when we sell a house, the money goes up to the broker owner, a small piece goes to the regional, and then another small piece goes to the international. So if you take out all that middle, EXP basically is international supporting the agents. So all that money that you're buying your broker's beach house, paying for all this expensive brick and mortar and desks and copy machines and phone systems and all this crap, all that goes away. So now we can allocate the money to us. Make sense? Wouldn't you rather build your beach house than somebody else's? All right, I'll go on a little bit. Um, so we're going to get into some of this cool stuff here. So a cloud-based environment, what does that look like? We have no desk fees. We can work from anywhere. Obviously, I'm sitting in my kitchen. Uh, if it was any warmer, I'd go outside to my bar where I should be for happy hour. We have no expensive leases, and I just talked about that. So we have this money. We have a lot of money left over, right? So we invest that in technology and leads for you and education and all this great stuff. Of course, we're paperless and we have instant access to training and support. And I'll get into that heavily in a minute. So Brent touched on this. So I want to tell you a story about me. The first time I saw Uber, I was like, wow, that's pretty cool. But I'm pretty sure I'm going to get ax murdered when I get into a freaking Uber. I'm getting into a stranger's car. That's crazy. So let's just say I was like kind of the last guy to get involved with Uber. iTunes iPhone. I never imagined getting rid of my BlackBerry for an iPhone. It doesn't even have buttons, you guys. And I was like, what do you mean buy a song, download it over the... No. iTunes, I was the last adopter to that. So same thing with Blockbuster, right? So Blockbuster had a very good chance to merge with Netflix or be bought by Netflix, and they said no. Blockbuster had millions and millions and millions of dollars of brick and mortar and leases. Netflix had what? online technology, online streaming, which cost way less, way more convenient. So you guys got to understand every time a disruptor comes in, it's kind of weird, right? People look at it and go, whoa, that's pretty cool. And everybody kind of stands back. Like right now, there's a lot of people standing back looking at EXP. What's going to happen with EXP, right? But then the disruptor grabs hold like we're doing right now and then takes over everything, right? Most people watching this probably barely remember where the blockbuster was. Circuit City. I used to go to Circuit City all the time to buy electronics. Now we buy it online, right? My favorite thing to talk about is Airbnb. Like these guys own no zero real estate and they're the number one real estate company in the world. So if you notice one thing in parallel with all these, online cloud-based environment only possible because of the internet. Let's be real. We're only possible due to the internet. Is the internet going away? No, we're in the worst crisis America's ever seen with this coronavirus, but our internet's still flying, right? You guys are all on here watching. Home addresses. <laughs> yeah. All right, so check this out. Live training. Our training is key as real estate agents. I'm a coach. I coach some of the top teams across the nation. And what I know about real estate agents, and I know where, I remember when I was 19, okay. struggling, when I was struggling trying to figure out uh, real estate, I didn't have enough training. I didn't have online. I didn't have anything demand. And I unfortunately had somebody that would come into the office once a month or every couple months and train us. But the learning curve was very, very slow. 
So an average agent would take two or three years before they started being good. Well, as a coach and as a trainer, I know, and from even working at KW when I trained all the agents over there, basically trained my competition, I, look, I said, look, the more seminars I can go to, and I got on a plane, I drove for hours, I went to all these seminars, Craig Proctor, Mike Ferry, you know, I mean, Brian Buffini, these guys were all my friends, and I stayed very close to them, Joe Stump, I mean, if I left you out, if you're watching this, I'm sorry, but I love you for training me. Now, what we have, and I'll even show you this, it's, it's ridiculous, and, and guess what? I get to go and, and show you other things, so I'm gonna show you other things real quick. I'm gonna show you our live training, or our training calendar, and give you a taste of what that looks like because I think it's freaking important. So I think I have my internet up right here. Um, so here is our schedule of training, right? So I'll make this a little bit bigger. So tomorrow is what, Thursday? So let's see what's gonna happen on Thursday, Thursday, March 26th. So we're gonna have, well, there's training in the UK, yeah, we're a global company. Uh, Excel series, EXP's top five EXP partnership that can lift your business, that's pretty cool. Navigate the EXP roadmap, that's pretty cool. But let's get into other little things, setting up your EXP business. How are you gonna make a lot of money converting leads? Huh, that's probably a pretty good class. Um, EXP world tour, and it just goes on and on. Seven, 10 classes a day, and then what are you doing on Friday? Do you wanna learn about, do you wanna talk to icon agents, agents selling 50, hundreds of homes a year? Do you wanna be on their panel or listen to them on a panel? Do you wanna learn about 360 tours, which are really hot right now? Um, how about video for real estate? I'd say video is a pretty big deal right now. And it just goes on and on. We can go into Monday and you'll just see goal setting and there's just all kinds of social media. You guys, I think you guys get the, I think you guys get the gist of it. There's a ton of training. And what I like to point out about these trainers is they are icon agents. They have to be masters of their craft, right? So they have to really know what they're doing and they're vetted extremely well. Like it took me months to be able to be approved to train in the world. So moving right along. So training's key, you guys, uh, real-time support. So when we go into the world, there's 500 employees sitting behind a computer ready to serve us. Imagine going to your brokerage right now, your broker's on the phone, at lunch, at their beach house that you bought them, their assistant might be there, somebody who maybe sold 20, 30 homes in their life and now they're the broker assistant. Maybe there's some admin there to help you. It's not real support. It's not like we have, we have support like you wouldn't believe. We have tech, we have onboarding, we have agent experience so they can give you the best experience. We have accounting, operations. We have all these different departments on a complete online campus and all these people are there to help you. Look at the hours, six to five, 6 a.m. to 5 or 9 a.m. to 8 p.m. Eastern Standard. Those are some pretty good hours to have all these people help you. The longest I've ever waited for help was maybe two or three minutes on a really busy day. So let's talk about international uh, collaboration. Mind blowing. Now, all agents at EXP, once, you, once it clicks in your head, you understand that we're all doing for the good of the company, you start collaborating with people from Canada, from the UK, from Australia, from Maine, from Seattle, from New York, Florida. It's crazy the collaboration and how much people are willing to help. And I'm gonna show you in Workplace a little bit later why that's so important and how it's so important and how easy it is. Um, if you ever wanted to build an expansion team, maybe you're watching this and your average price range is 350 and you're like, no man, I wanna be where Mike's at. His average price range is 650 and double your income. You could build, with our tools and technology, you can build an expansion team anywhere you want. We have the CRMs, we have the leads, we have the technology, we have the communication platform. You can lead a team like I do all over the country and do it really simply and easily. Um, all right, this is what I love, stock. Now, I'll do be honest, when I came to the company, I wasn't that excited about the stock. I was like, yeah, and it's just my fault because I didn't really know about stock. I never cared about stock. I wasn't a big stock guy. Yes, I have mutual funds, but I just leave them in the bank. I never care, I never look, and it grows and whatever. Today, I probably shouldn't say how much I have. I want this to be evergreen, but it's a crap ton of stock, right? Um, we get stock and we get awarded for doing things that we do anyways. So you do your first transaction. They give you a couple hundred bucks in stock. You cap out, which is only 16 grand. You get $400 in stock. When you sponsor an agent or refer an agent to the company, they do their first transaction, you get 400 bucks. This happens several times throughout the years, guys. So it ends up to be thousands of dollars. 
So where you're on some crazy split with no cap and you're spending all this money on your brokerage, they keep finding ways to reward us for doing things that we do anyways. Now let me blow your mind with the agent, oh gosh, the agent icon award. This is where things get really serious. Our cap, we're on an 80-20 split and it caps out at 16,000, right? After 16,000, our transaction fees go to 250,000. So basically, in my area, you sell five or six homes, you're capped out. $250, not yeah. $250,000. Oh, $250, yeah, <laughs> transaction fee. And then once you go over to 20 more sales, you become what's called an icon. Sorry, my dog is scratching me to death. And what that means is you have the ability to earn all of your cap back in stock. So imagine where you're at now, if you're not at eXp, I know some of you on this are at eXp, Imagine if you're at Cold Banker, KW, or one of those other places, when you cap out and sell 20 more homes, you get a medal. Here, you get your cap back. Like imagine getting your cap back in stock. Now, when I joined the company, stock was somewhere around $3. It's been as high as 18. It's fluctuating somewhere around 10 or 11 or nine. I don't even know where it's at now, but who knows with coronavirus going on, but I'm not gonna look at it. Um, in the agent equity program, and this is where I've gotten a lot of stock. So imagine, and this was hard for me to imagine when I was new, I sell a house, I take 5%, which is nothing, you don't even feel that anyways, right? I take 5% and I buy stock uh, at a 10% discount at our company. Now, I didn't care about this at first, and I was talking to my financial planner about eXp, and I was having him you know, research the stock and helping me get excited about it. He goes, dude, are you kidding me? You're making 10% on your money the day you close escrow. And I was like, oh, thanks, Chad, 825 today. Still awesome. So I'm like, wait a minute. Okay, I make 10% of my money the day I close escrow. That's a big deal, you guys. Where else can you make 10% on your money? So, yeah. and of course, stocks go up and down. Talk to your financial planner, blah, 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 blah. Um, so moving along, and of course, you can buy stock too. All right, so this is what all the hoopla is about. This is what I'm going to try to explain to you. Uh, the best way I can. You guys remember, we're a real estate company first. We have things in place, our CRMs, all kinds of stuff, and we're gonna show you a couple of these things down here in a minute. Um, but what I wanna talk about right now is the revenue share plan. That's, that's where everybody gets excited and that's what we wanna do. Now remember, we take out the broker owner, we take out the regional owner, so all the money is left over. This is where people need to understand there's a tremendous amount of money left over. So I call this part compensation for contribution. Contribution means you're going to introduce people to the company like you probably have anyways. When I worked at Remax, I introduced tons of people to the company. I was probably the number one recruiter at my KW office. As a matter of fact, I know I was. And I would bring agents over all the time. I loved the culture, I bled red, I liked the training because I was doing all the training, I, all these wonderful things. What did I ever get? Very, very little. My biggest check ever at KW was 1200 bucks. I made over 3000 my second month here. So let me talk to you a little bit about revenue share. It can get a little confusing. Just try to wrap your head around the very simple basics and I'll try to make it as simple as possible. If you refer a company, an agent to our company, you can get up to $2,800 a year for that agent if they cap. They don't have to cap. They, they, as soon as they start selling, you get paid the very next month, up to $2,800, anybody that you personally sponsor. So imagine if you had five people, right? Five times 2,800, voila, that's extra income that you're gonna get. Now, your second level, if you bring five agents to the company and then you go over five, you now open up your second level. Instead of getting 2800 Glenn Sanford knew that he wanted to be the most collaborative payment structure there was. So David, my sponsor who's on here, he helps me get other agents. Why? Because not only is he a good sponsor and he's good for the company, but he gets more money than he does from me when I'm involved in the company. This goes seven generations, and you can see the numbers here, 2,800, 3,200, 2, 12, 8, 2, and then the grand poobah is level seven. When you hired 40 agents to our company or attracted 40 agents to our company, you now make $4,000, up to $4,000 a year off that. 
So I'll just make this simple and do a little bit of math because I'm not a real good math guy. Gene Frederick, one of the godfathers of our company taught me this and this is just what I've been attracting agents with since I got here. So imagine you hire six agents. Let's say that takes you two years, you know, maybe one every couple months. Now, it doesn't take a genius to know that attracting an agent to the best company on the planet every few months is a big deal. So let's say it takes you two years to get six agents, right? Six times 2,800 is 16,800. And when he told me that, it was interesting to me because I said, hmm, my cap is gone. Do you guys realize you're now working at a company for free? I know it breaks your heart if you're watching this from a different company, but this is true and this is real. And I did this in the first couple of weeks of working at this company. So my cap went away. I now work for a company that pays me compensation for contribution, right? This is where things get crazy. Your second level, you hire each agent on your first level hires one agent, one agent. That's all they have to do. You now make $3,200, which is $19,200 or $36,000 a year. Now, when I go around the country and train agents and talk about this, I ask them, raise your hand if $3,000 a month would make a difference in your life. All hands like this, right? The average house payment, rent, shelter, whatever you wanna call it, is less than $3,000 a month around the country. So imagine your house payment being made or your cap being gone and still having half your house payment paid. However you need to think about it in your mind, this is, this is a game changer, guys. So then if you ever watch Gene's videos, he talks about one that really grabbed my attention and his daughters, Nicole, who's a really good friend of mine now, 10 who bring 10. And this is what I tell agents. If you're going to take attracting agents seriously, think of this number. I want to help 10 agents on my front line, right? My first level. I want to help them bring 10 agents each. So if you have your first level, 10 agents times 2,800, that's 20 grand, 28 grand a year. Cool, very good. Second level, now if 10 bring 10, that's 100, right? Times 3,200, that turns into $320,000 a year. You add that up to 348, and it's $29,000 a month. Okay, that's pretty good. Now, $350,000 a year, I'm pretty sure is what most, more than most agents make at all. Again, I'll say we're a real estate company first, but think about this extra income and it happens pretty naturally. I'm not gonna say it's super passive because I do work at bringing agents to the company, but it's not that big of a deal. So I won't share my whole story again because I want this to be evergreen, but this has happened in our very first year of working at this company. All right, so we could spend more time on this later. There's calculators, there's spreadsheets, there's all kinds of way to look at this. But if you, if you knew that you could bring six agents to the company and they're always gonna bring a buddy and make three grand a month and you're now not paying the company, that's a game changer. And I want you guys to take that really seriously. So let's talk about the fun stuff. Our world. Our world is spectacular. Our world is cloud-based. You could work from anywhere. I've worked from the beach. I've worked from a lot of cities. I just pop up on my laptop like this. And most of the higher ups or people that have been at our company for a long time say, don't show them the world. Just talk about it. You know what? This is my webinar. I'm going to show you the world, right? So hopefully our internet's stable enough. I'm going to open this up. A little icon, real simple. Takes a second to open, of course. And this is our world. It drops us into a waiting area. And now we're closed, obviously, in the world. So hopefully my internet can handle this. Are you on the internet? You better go. All right, cool. So this is our world, right? You can walk around. You can see the training schedules. You can cruise around. You can fly all the way to our tech outpost, right? If you have a tech question, you click on this and they will come help you. You can go to your broker room. So it'll say broker state room. So whatever state you're in, I'm in California. I click on California. I'm now in here. So during the day, during business hours, there's a receptionist and all of our brokers work in here. So we can just cruise around and walk right into our brokers. We have an amazing broker team in California, by the way. 
And I could just say, hmm, okay. And if they're sitting in there, I'll walk in there and talk to them. Also, what we have, which I love, is now we have our, our office, our private team suite, right? So never before have I been able to work with Dave and the rest of my sponsorship team and the rest of our team um, that, I, that I love so much. And we get to work with them every single day now. What just happened? Please go in there. And I'll show you how we are living, working, and surviving during Corona. Why isn't this working? Come on, that's not a very good demonstration. Nope, not there either. <laughs> so we went into the demo. Let me try this one more time. Oh, I hit close, not submit. That's why I wasn't then, it was me. All right, so watch. So this is Rosie's office. This is Sir David Golden's office. This is, if you guys don't know, my nickname is Sugar Bear. So it says, hey guys, myself. So you can come in here and hang out with me anytime you want. You can see my podcasts on the wall, my website on the wall. I can sit down, I could have meetings, I could bring clients. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. What's up, brother? <laughs> Thank you for coming in. So since we're both on the webinar, we're getting feedback. But normally we could talk normal. All right, so you guys dig that? I think that's pretty cool. So we're living in a world that most people can't even imagine. Um, so that's our world. You can talk to anybody. You can drive boats. You can play soccer, all kinds of cool stuff. Let's talk real quick about our insurance. So according to NAR, 28 to 33% of realtors are not insured. That's sad, right? EXP takes it to the next level. We have health insurance. I'm not gonna spend a lot of time on that. We can talk about it later. We can take you into the world talk. But it sounds to me from what I gather, they save about 30 to 40% on health insurance. That is amazing. I know Dave has it. He could probably speak to I, that. I do have it and it is awesome. I, I had to pay, I've had two heart surgeries and I had to pay like 800 bucks, 900 bucks a month for health insurance. And I got, I got with these guys and it's like 400 bucks a month and it's incredible, great coverage. So I'm very grateful for it. That's rad. Yeah. All right, let's talk about some of the meat and potatoes of this thing, you guys. All right, so EXP Enterprise, I'm gonna show you that in a second. Mind blowing. This is what is our CEO of our company and this is our, where we get to everything. Um, we have Skyslope, paperless transaction, used all over the world by all the top companies, nothing new. Workplace by Facebook, I'm gonna show you, and our CRM, and our branding and marketing. So I'm gonna get out of here, and I love to be in control of this because no other webinars will you ever get to see all this cool stuff. I think I'm already logged in. So you go in here, you sign in, and then here's our dashboard, okay? So the first thing I wanna show you is, oh, I already showed you guys the um, training schedule. Now I wanna show you KV Core. KV Core is a CRM that costs you about $600 a month if you were to buy it off the street, if you were an a, a, a EXP agent. There's all sorts of little chats. They tell you all the cool stuff that's coming up with, with their CRMs, and I'm not interested in that right now, but it is very handy, I promise you. You guys, CRM matters, and it matters a freaking lot, right? This is where you are gonna drive traffic and leads to everything you have. If you guys can't build a landing page in five minutes at the company you're at right now, take a look at this. Let's just choose Mike and start building a landing page. So let's say today I wanted to post on Facebook. Hmm, let's say I'm going to click here and say Santa, Clarita, REO, right? And now I can say um, best, oops, the best deals on REO, whatever, right? So then I can take this and I can say, I don't know, zero down and so on and so forth, right? I can take this, copy paste, they put in their email, their cell phone, and then they get to see the list. This is all customizable. And what I really love about it is let's say you wanted to do a video plus lead. Now you can embed a YouTube video 
just like this is here. And it'll just simply say, it'll say, hey guys, this is Mike Bjorkman. One of the benefits of working with Team Bjorkman is we have the ability to share the top five REOs this week for you. Simply enter your information below and I'll send you the list, right? Who can do that? If you can't do that, you need to very seriously consider where you're at. All right, so let's go back. And maybe you want to say, uh, da, 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 da. let's close this out. I have all these controls and everything in front of me. Sorry, you guys. Um, so let's say you wanted to build an incredible squeeze page. If you guys don't know what squeeze page is, Google that. But I'm going to show you how you can IDX use. So you can put search criteria. Let's say the best view homes in Santa Clarita between 500 and 700,000. So now you're narrowing it down to price ranges. So there's a lot of strategy with price ranges. Uh, and then you can start running traffic, Google AdWords. We even have a company called Make It Rain. My dogs are coming in. Yeah, guess what happens when you work from home? Um, you, we have a company called Making It Rain where you can pay them and they will advertise for you. No different than Commission Zinc or Boomtown or Tiger Leads or all those. And oh, we're gonna have dogs eating next to us. How cool is that, Sorry. everybody? <laughs> My wife, she's not used to me working from home. How cool is that? So you can build a full landing page just like that. Let me show you guys something else, the lead engine. Now I'm spending some more time on this because it's freaking incredible. Um, CMA builder, you're not gonna find a better CMA faster. Call capture leads. If you don't know what 800 numbers are and call captures that launch campaigns for your buyers and sellers, you guys see why this is $600 a month normally? Millions Mapped is an incredible app that you can give to your clients that coincide with your CRM and campaigns. Open House app. If you guys aren't having an iPad on a stand in your open house and saying, hey, welcome to our open house, sign that iPad right there to be entered into our $100 drawing for a barbecue dinner tonight. They go, that. are you looking to buy a home? Yes or no, price range, boom. Launches a campaign. Before they leave the open house, they have listings in their hand. They click on them. What, what happens next? AI, artificial intelligence says, hey, you clicked on this house three times. When would you like to see it, right? And it's not only that, it's dynamic. If they start looking in the next town over, it'll start to send them those homes too. You guys, this is insane. So I won't spend any more time on the CRM. I can spend more time on it with you later. And then I'm gonna go back to uh, our workplace for Facebook. You guys, this is where 28,000 agents are collaborating. You don't have this at Remax. You don't have this at KW. You don't have this. Here's a group where people like to drop their listing presentations in for you to copy, borrow, steal, or modify, right? Uh, EXP University, really interesting. Let's see what that looks like. Let's click on our university. And now you have tons and tons and tons of classes that you can take anytime you want on demand. I, it's kind of a no-brainer there. Um, we have KV Core Discussion, where they talk about the CRMs. We have groups. You can create your own groups. You can create your own team groups. Water cooler chat. If you still feel the need to go to your office and sit around the water cooler and chat, this is where you would do that. Talk about our stock. Talk about anything, our charities, marketplace, where you can buy and sell things, tips. It goes on and on. All right, so let's get out of here. And then the last thing I want to show you in real time is our marketing. This is Breakthrough Broker. If you guys haven't used Breakthrough Broker before, it is the top editable instant um, marketing material you could ever want. If you run a team, all the pressure's off of you because your agents can now come in and make flyers, postcards. You can create a door hanger now and be ready to door knock tomorrow. Uh, it's just crazy how fast you can edit buyer and listing presentations. If you guys don't know in the next market we're gonna deal with, like I went on a listing appointment today, Marketing, they had my listing presentation in front of them today. Pretty, pretty important. So anyway, so let's blow through that. Let's see if there's anything crucial in the chat. Um, yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is cool, right? Hey, Mike. Yeah. Can you, can you do your listing presentation real quick? Like just flip through it, just like two seconds of it? Sure. So one of the things, another software that we give you when you join our organization is Maxa software. And we, I do all my listing presentations over the zoom like this. So if you wanted to click sell and speaking of happy hour, yeah, I'm going for more. So whoops, that went straight to the, this is a Y Lopo site, by the way. Uh, oh, I should have showed you the site that we get with KV core, which is awesome. Uh, marketing strategy. Here we go. 
So you guys all have the ability to use this um, and we can help you create this and we can also host it on your KV Core websites. So you click here, we can make it bigger and we can just start cruising through our listing presentation. And I talk about all the cool things that our team offers and all this cool stuff. And yes, this is live on my website right now at teambjorkman.com. You guys are more than happy more than welcome, I should say, to go check it out and uh, enjoy. So that's how I give all my listing presentations. If you want to join my coaching programs, reach out to me. They're all free. You can join in at any time and it'll show you how to do this um, and how to list homes over the internet. All right, so let's get back to experience. <laughs> Sorry, we get so sidetracked. And you know what, that's fine. It's, it's my happy hour, it's my webinar, I don't care. Um, so the other thing I was gonna tell you guys is so many agents are stressed out about their website and it's almost worth going back in. All right, I'm gonna do it real quick. So, sorry guys, but it's, it's important because I know there's people that are gonna be watching this that are like stressed out because they don't have a website. Um, so let's go back into KV Core, wherever the heck that is. And I just wanna show you real quick how easy it is. Click on Web and IDX. And you don't have to do anything, you guys. Your website is already built for you. All you have to do is run your own domain to this and watch this. It's already built. We did nothing to this website at all except upload our photo and a background in the video. It's fully IDX driven. Any multifamily houses, land, condos, and it's got everything you could ever want. If you look at the top of this, it's got search, sell your home, other, and you can change all these things, resources, change all these things. So if you guys are stressed out about a really high quality IDX driven website that connects to a very robust CRM, worry no more. All right, hope you guys dug that. <laughs> All right, so back to this. So let's get into the downhill side of this thing. So I wanna to talk to you guys about joining our company. Now, whoever invited you to watch this video or whoever invited you to this webinar, I want you to reach out virtually because it's Corona time, hug them and kiss them because they have just changed your life. That person, whoever told you about this webinar should and would be your sponsor. And you're going to have an amazing collaborative team of seven people to help you. Um, but this is, what, this is where everybody goes, okay, I love the company, I love all the features, the benefits, the tools, technology, the revenue share, the stock. Tell me what I, what's the catch, right? Here it is, this is how simple it is, you guys. $149 to start up, includes your first month of your tech fee or whatever they call that. Who cares, you get business cards, folders, I don't know, doesn't matter, who cares for 150 bucks. $85 a month for your cloud brokerage. Let me tell you, you get the CRM, you get the workplace, you get the marketing, you get the education, you get all the, the CEO, the background, the sky slope, and you get the cloud-based office for $85 a month. Like, if you even think about that, you're crazy. $25 a file broker review, I think that's very fair. Most companies that I talk to, they're 150 to 250 for a, a transaction fee for the broker. $40 E&O. I'm in California, this might not be a big deal to you. It's capped out at $500. Coming from a brokerage where I spent 25,000, 30,000 every quarter, this is a big deal to me. $500 a year, you know, or $40 a transaction as you go. It's not up front. In Southern California where I'm at, they'll take $1,200 a year out of your first transaction plus $100 a transaction. So e and is a big deal to me. The commission is super simple, guys. 80-20 split up to 16 grand. After 16 grand, it goes to $250 a transaction. Once you hit icon and hit 20 more sales, it goes down to 75. Yes, there's a mega agent program. Yes, there's other programs. A little bit more explanation about the icon program. I don't wanna to get too much into that here, but whoever sent you this video or this webinar can explain that to you in full detail because there are some amazing programs. I had an agent the other day from KW, a big agent says, Mike, you don't understand. I get such a good deal with my team their uh, caps are X. And I'm like, what? The amount of production you do, we can get your team down to a $4,000 a year cap. That's a mega agent team. So you can reach out and ask about that. So it's super simple to join you guys. Um, you can fill out the application online, but I'll finish with this. We are the fastest growing company on the planet, the most fun company on the planet, the most collaborative planet <laughs> company on the planet. We're doing things that other brokerages can or won't. We're doing things that other agents can't or won't. And we're having a blast doing it. We're changing lives. And I'll, I'll say this one thing and I don't wanna like get all sappy. 
you guys, our business has changed in the last couple of weeks with coronavirus. Dave and I were just looking a minute ago at our revenue share. Mm -hmm. We're only five days into the month. We're making more money this month than we, this month in five days than we already did in our whole month last month. If I don't sell a home for the next three, four, five months, EXP, my diversity, my revenue share is paying my bills and not very many agents can say that. You don't have to come recruit, but you'll see and other people will see how happy and successful you are. You'll naturally attract people. So I don't know. This is how simple it is, you guys. Join.exprealty.com. It's really hard to see down here. Join.exprealty.com. Send me a message, Dave, a message. Whoever invited you to this webinar should and would be your sponsor. Um, what do you think, Dave? Did we nail it pretty good? Is there anything else to cover? Yeah, man. I mean, it's just, that, that's the thing. It's like, I, I love the, the features and benefits of this company so much, but the reality is <clears throat> it's all about what it can do for you in your life. And what it's done for me in my life is just given me absolute and total freedom. Um, you know, I've sold over 18,000 properties in my career. I've owned two massive Keller Williams brokerages and, uh, you know, number one agent at Realty One and blah, 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 26 REO clients. And, and all that stuff doesn't really matter at the end of the day, because I was still on the hamster wheel. And until I figured this part out where it's all about residual income and having ownership, that's the piece that all realtors are missing. And that's the piece that, that EXP can give you. And that's what it gave me. So now I don't have to worry. I don't have to stress out about deals falling out of escrow or my overhead being too high or paying all my staff and not being able to afford to pay my staff. So I'm taking money out of my own pocket to pay my staff or whatever the case may be. Right. A lot of companies are freaking out right now, especially brokerage brokerage owners that have lots of overhead. And guess what? I have $85 a month in overhead. I don't even have an assistant and I've got almost a thousand people on my revenue share team. I mean, it's, it's, it's crazy. So, I have to point out something, Dave, since this is our webinar now. I want to say something to you team leaders out there or agents that want to be a team leader. I've heard agents say to me, I don't want to disrupt my team. I don't want to freak my team out. Listen to me, team leaders. You are financially and selfish, irresponsible for not helping your team. Do you know those people on your team would die for a 401k? Do you know they would die for residual income and passive income? Do you know they would love a CRM that actually works? Do you know they would love to have top agents across the country training them? Do you know they would love to freaking collaborate with the top people in the nation, some of the top agents in the world at our conventions? If you are not willing to introduce this to your team, it's financially irresponsible and it's financially irresponsible not to join our company, but you are being selfish and you need to share this with your team and let them make the decision because you're being selfish. You're like, Oh, I don't want to freak out my team. That's BS. You need to think about what you're saying right now. Cause if you really truly care about your team, this is where teams are made and this is where teams are bred and this is where teams succeed. Mm -hmm. If, if you're, if you're a team leader and you're so stressed out about your top agent leaving you, when I get a hold of them or when they see this, they're going to leave. Now, guess what? What happens when a team separates, they start talking trash, there's animosity. It's a terrible feeling and nobody wants to do that. At our company, you say, look, you know, Joe, you wanna go on your own? I still support you 100%, still come to our meetings, it's still all hugs, let's build your team. Let's take you to the next level. Stay at the company and let's go crazy. There's never been a better retention plan, a better compensation plan, a better marketing plan. Like you now have ability for your agents to drive traffic and sell homes on their own and be on your team. So I deal with a lot of team leaders, so I wanted to, I wanted to say that because it's financially irresponsible and selfish not to at least let them see what we got, what we have. Yeah. And broker owners, reach out to us. Reach out to us. Like, we can help you. We've been you. We understand what that's like. <laughs> yeah, we've been you're you. Feeling, we understand the pressure you're feeling right now. We understand it. And so, so don't go at it alone. That's the beauty of this model, that you become business partners with all of us. Right? That's, how, that's the beauty of this model. So, so let's, let's talk collaborate about together. Let's talk about our team. Let's talk about, so if you guys, let's just say hypothetically, and I know there's people all over the place watching this, but if you join our team, right? I have Dave, my sponsor. I already told you his credentials in the beginning. Above him is Rosie Rodriguez. 
total boss babe, huge portfolio of commercial, residential, owns a farmer's insurance agency, a mortgage company, an escrow company. She's an amazing coach and a life coach. Above her, Rick Jiha, one of the top coaches in the nations. Both of them own KWs. You already talked to Brent Gove above Rick. Above Rick, Sheila Farajan, one of the nicest, sweetest ladies. Boss, oh, she's amazing. Like all these people are here at any given time for you. Most teams in this, in this company are the same way. We're one for all, all for one. Never before in real estate has that happened. You might go to your office and say, oh, these are my boys or my girls, this is my squad. No, they go out a listing appointment. When you're going, they're gonna eat you, doggy dog, stab you in the back. Here, I just say, oh, you take that, I'll help you, at minimum we'll co-list it. Like collaboration at its finest, you guys, our team, like I get tears in my eyes how close we are. We've never had an opportunity to work all over the country like this together. We are partners, we are like this, we're family. And there's no borders. I don't care what state you're in, Canada, Australia, UK, we're gonna open four to five countries a year. We yeah. are a real squad. Yeah, so Mike and I, Mike and I and, and a few others actually, we go travel and we go, we go visit. Right now we can't because of the coronavirus stuff, but I mean we just we just popped we just popped over to, to, to Iowa, to Minnesota, to Toronto, to Miami, to fly it's just like all we go everywhere. And we're planning on going to Cleveland and we're planning on going to Denver and we're planning on going like all over the place. And so we will go to your town and help you build in your in your town. Um, you know, when this thing is over. <laughs> but but we could do it. And right now we could just do it online. But um, that's why we're doing all this stuff too. But, but yeah, we'll, we'll go to you. We will help you. We'll hold your hand. We'll walk you through it. We'll support you. And we'll support the other teams at, the, at, the, at this company, uh, even if they don't, right? Like, so we're coaching, we're training, and we're leading agents better than their current broker. And that's what we want you guys to understand. We have EXP Pros, our Facebook group, which you're all welcome to join. We have Agent Mechanics Coaching Group, which is my coaching group, which is a free 90-day program. It's everything you need to you know, take off. We have David Knox coaching. We have, we have everything you could ever dream of our podcast, our YouTube channel. It just, the education doesn't stop. It doesn't end. And yes, you're going to drink through a fire hose, but wouldn't you rather have so much positivity being slapped in your face than being lonely and not having the resources it takes to be a real badass agent? Maybe you only want to sell one or two homes a month. That's cool. How about you make three or five grand a month on top of that, whether you sell houses or not? How about you have stock in a company? How about you have an exit plan? How about you have, you know, a 401k, if you will, with our company? There's so many reasons to stay and to come. It's ridiculous. What else, Dave? What are we missing? I feel like we're missing things. We're always missing something. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so, so, so to go to check it out, just go to join.exprealty.com. Join.exprealty.com and submit your application from there. You'll start the process. Your broker won't be notified. Nothing else, nothing's going to happen. They're not transferring your license. You got to do that yourself. Um, but you start the onboarding process that way. And um, you can get it done in a couple of days or three days or a week, whatever, however, however quick or slow you want to do it. Um, but yeah, reach out to us if you have any more questions. And blow up question and answer right now. We have Q&A time. What time is it? Oh, yeah, we did, we did good. yeah, so if you guys have any questions and answers, pop them in there now. I know a lot of these questions that you have are confident, uh, are confident, I hope they're confident, confidential, but we're, we're more than happy to respect your confidentiality. I was the same way. I was like, oh my God, I don't want anybody to see I was researching this company. Um, but man, so, and, and, and still just reach out to us and let me see, I got questions and answers on my text messages even. Great job, off to dinner. <laughs> All right, guys. Um, it's really easy to get a hold of us on Facebook, on uh, Instagram, doesn't matter, LinkedIn. Uh, reach out to us and we'll talk to you guys a little later. Dave, any closing thoughts? That's it, man. All right. Love you guys. Later. See you on the bright side.